Hi guys, I want to show you my new solar panel system. Uh, it has 19 solar panels and uh, the sun power X335. They are rated at uh, 335 watts each in uh, lab conditions, but in reality I haven't gotten them to produce more than 255 watts each. That, with that being said, right now it's winter, so in the summertime when the sun is really strong and falls at a very high angle, I'm sure that energy production will improve. Anyway, this system is uh, rated at 6.5 kilowatts. And uh, let's go to the inverter and see how much energy we're producing right now. As you can see, it's a very nice day, blue sky, very sunny. And when the sky is dark blue, there is usually very low humidity in the air, so the solar rays can pass through the atmosphere very easily. And that is a good thing. Okay, let's go to the power inverter. This is my net meter. System was installed on uh, December 24th, and right now it's January 30th. So, so far we've used 517 kilowatts net. Usually my energy consumption is about 700 kilowatts a month. So, uh, that's pretty good so far. Anyway, this is my Aurora PVI 6000 inverter. It has two channels and it's rated up to 6000 watts. Of course, it can produce more, slightly more, but that's the rating. And uh, as you can see right now, it's, uh, it's almost 215 and we're producing 3000 or somewhere around 4 kilowatts right now. And uh, I think the daily production peaked at 4.6 kilowatts at uh, 12.30. So, uh, yeah, these are some of the specs here for my system. As you can see, the inverter is very quiet, working very nicely. And uh, right now my meter is actually measuring backwards. Putting power into the grid. And um, we're fortunate here in the northeast in my state that we actually have net metering. So whatever we produce and whatever we consume is uh, calculated at the same price. There's absolutely no catches, nothing. And uh, in addition to that, we have the SRX certificates, which I uh, haven't produced any yet, but hopefully in a few months I'll have one. And uh, if you're not sure exactly what an SRX certificate is, it's a certificate for renewable energy, which uh, the state gives you, and then you can auction it online. And you can get anywhere from 200 bucks to somewhere around 290 if you're lucky and we'll see how it's gonna work but I'll keep you updated and uh, another thing I want to show you here is uh, I forgot to tell you on this system I have three strings and uh, two strings are attached to one channel of the inverter and another string is attached to the other channel and also for every two solar panels I have one Tigo energy maximizer which really helps balance the load and if there's any, any shading issues anything like that that will the maximizers will compensate and will optimize the system so uh, right now as you can see 15 minutes earlier at uh, 151 we're producing 4.3 kilowatts and uh, so far today, we've produced 17.48 kilowatts. So by the end of the day, I'm expecting 
somewhere around 23 kilowatts. We still have a couple more hours of some strong sunlight. And uh, this is my solar panel here layout. I have two strings of six panels and one string of seven panels on the left side. This is a really cool application here because it allows me to see the production at any point in time and also lets me compare you know how much energy I've produced compared to other days we can see on the 30th it's colored in yellow so we're producing power right now let's go on the 29th takes a little time to load Yeah, it's taking usually long right now. Maybe a bad connection or something. Anyway, let me go back and see. Okay, so here you can see this is the 29th of January and we have produced 20.32 kilowatts and also if I go here to chat you can see a nice graph here it shows you the production per hour during the day, then we can go to week, month, this is a very helpful tool here, the monthly production, and as you can see we haven't had too many good days, but it's January in the northeast, shitty weather, and here we can see the annual production, we've produced 437 kilowatts so far. And like I said, the system was started on November, on December 24, 2013. So, a month and a half, 437 kilowatts. So, alright guys, hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, please check out my next video where I'm going to share my design plans and electrical connections and so on. Hope you enjoyed this video and please subscribe to my channel. Thank you.